welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. My name is Kaylee and today's class is a 20 minute strength and cardio power vinyasa. This is a style of class that I incorporate strong, fast paced, dynamic movements with strength work to create a whole body strong workout that is body weight to no equipment needed. I taught this type of class on my app recently and I did something a little bit different so I wanted to bring it here because everyone absolutely loved the class and it's one of my most watched classes in the last few months. So how it works is we will do sort of three reps of a movement from one pose to another and it creates a really dynamic and fluid flow. So if you like to hold poses for longer in a more traditional vinyasa class, this probably isn't the one for you, but I invite you to try something new and maybe you will love it. We will get our heart rate up for sure, so make sure you have some water and if you like a block or a strap close by just in case, go ahead and grab those. There's also a Spotify playlist in the description if you like music, and let's jump into it. We're going to start in a child's pose. Feet together, knees wide. Extend the fingers forward. Let the forehead rest. That could be on the mat. You could grab a block to bring the floor up to you. You could make a pillow with the hands. Just settling into a place that feels supportive for you in this moment. And as always in the first few minutes of class, I invite you to check in with your physical body, your emotion and feeling in the mind in this moment. your energy levels, and just taking all of those things into account and knowing that there is no right or wrong way to feel in this moment and that by making our way to the mat, we will shift our energy, physical sensation, feelings, and emotions. But I invite you to just be open to what is here for you, not needing to try hard to change any one thing. Let's take a breath together. Inhale. Exhale, big audible sigh, let it go. Again like that, breathe in. And empty. One more full breath in. And exhale, let it go. Find your ujjayi breath. Slight constriction at the back of the throat. And then stretch the fingers forward if they aren't already. Let your next inhale carry you up to a tabletop. And your exhale, press the hips back. Child's pose. Again, like that. Inhale, shift forward. And exhale, shift back. Inhale, shift forward this time. Exhale, bend the elbows. Baby Chaturanga. Inhale, press back up. Exhale, childs. A couple times like this, shifting forward and back. Starting to warm up the shoulders, the upper body, the core. Last time, bend the elbows, hold. And then release all the way down onto the belly. Extend the legs long behind you. Draw the shoulder blades together. Press into the feet. Inhale, baby cobra. Lift the heart. Exhale, release. Again, like that, inhale to lift. And exhale to lower. This time, hands come wider than the mat. Come onto your fingertips, elbows high. Use your inhale to lift. Your exhale, drop right shoulder, gaze left. Inhale, move back through center. Exhale, drop left shoulder, gaze right. Side to side. One more time, each side. And then come back through center. Landing sphinx. Elbows pull underneath the shoulders. 
Press into the palms, tuck the toes under behind you. Breathe in, lift through the heart. On your breath out, lift the hips, forearm plank. Inhale, lower to tap the belly and the thighs. Exhale, lift, forearm plank. Inhale, lower. And exhale, lift. One more time, inhale, lower. And exhale, lift. Holding here, press into the elbows and drag them isometrically back towards the ribs. Beautiful. And then start to walk the feet in for dolphin. One hand, or one foot rather, at a time. Hips lift up above the shoulders, maybe. You could shift the weight forward into the toes to bring the weight into the shoulders. And then gently release the knees to the mat. On your inhale, drop the belly, lift the tail. On your exhale, straighten the arms as you tuck the chin to the chest. Inhale, drop the elbows, drop the belly. Exhale, straighten the arms, curl in. Couple more times like that. Funky cat cows. If the traditional variation works better for your body, feel free to take that instead. Last time. Holding in your cat pose, really push into the hands, tuck the chin towards the chest. And then inhale back to neutral, tuck the toes under, exhale down, dog hips high. Take one bend into one knee and then the other. Maybe you sway the hips a little bit side to side, shake the head. Coming back to your breath, coming back to noticing. On your inhale, lift the heels, gaze to the top of the mat. Exhale, land in a forward fold. Inhale, lengthen the spine halfway. Exhale, fold Uttanasana. Again, like that, inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, fold. One more time, inhale, lengthen. And exhale, fold. Inhale, rise all the way up to stand. Extended mountain, arms lift high to the sky. Root into your heels, maybe the gaze lifts. Exhale, fold over the legs, Uttanasana. Inhale, Arda. Exhale, plant the hands, step back, high plank. Moment to pause, press into the hands, gaze forward and down, strong through the core. Breathe in, breathe out, stay. Inhale, shift forward, exhale, lower halfway, chaturanga, option for the belly. Inhale, roll over the toes, upward facing dog or cobra. Exhale, hips high, downward facing dog. Really drop through the head here. Let the chin tuck in towards the chest. Feel that length in the back of the neck, the cervical spine. Breathe in. And breathe out. On your inhale, lift the heels. Exhale, top of the mat. Half lift, breath in. Fold, breath out. Inhale is chair. Bend the knees, sweep the arms to the sky. Sit the hips back and down. Tailbone heavy, spine long. Reach the fingers high, draw your shoulder blades together, broaden through the collarbones. Breathe in, breathe out, open twist. Left arm forward, right arm back. Inhale, come back through center. Same side, open twist to the right. Inhale, come back through center. Exhale, open twist, this time stay. Breathe in, breathe out, hands to heart center, lean forward and hook, left elbow on, right thigh. Use the hands as leverage to twist and open through the heart. Breathe in. And breathe out. On your inhale, chair, arms lift to the sky. Exhale, stay. Inhale is left knee to chest, one legged Tadasana. Exhale, sit back low, chair. Inhale, left knee to chest. Exhale, sit low, chair. One more time, inhale, left knee to chest. Exhale, sit low. This time, left knee to chest and stay. Flex through the left toes. Breathe in. Breathe out, airplane. Sweep the arms back. Extend the left leg. Hinge the torso forward. Inhale, stand. Left knee to chest. Exhale, airplane. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. This time, stay. Draw the shoulder blades together. Reach the crown of the head forward. And now next, inhale, reach the arms forward. Interlace the fingers. 
press the palms away, breathe in. Breathe out, palms face the body, hug the knee to the chest and push the hands into the thigh. Inhale, extend the arms long, reach. Exhale, palms to the thigh, press in. One more time, inhale, extend. Exhale, hug it in. This time, come all the way up, slide the palms to the shin, standing leg raise. Draw the shoulders back in space first. You can stay with left hand at the knee or take left hand to big toe or outside of the foot. Right arm lifts to the sky. Press down into your right foot. Breathe in. Breathe out, open to B variation. Left leg to the left, right arm to the right. Inhale back through A, everything to center. Exhale, open B. One more time, inhale and exhale. Beautiful, inhale, land back in center. Keep the leg long, arms reach overhead. On your exhale, sweep it back, flying crescent. Bend into your right knee until the toes tuck under. Breathe in. Breathe out, take a moment to pause. Next, inhale, third to straighten through the right leg as you reach the fingers forward. Long, modified pyramid. Exhale, bend into the knee, sweep the arms back. Inhale, reach the fingers forward. Exhale, reach it back. One more time, inhale, reach it forward. And exhale, reach it back. Inhale, high crescent this time. Arms to the sky, take a moment to settle into the legs. Deep bend in the right knee, hips square to the front of the mat. Breathe in. Breathe out, open twist. Left arm forward, right arm back. Inhale through center. Exhale, open twist. One more time, inhale, center. Exhale, open twist, stay. Breathe in. Breathe out. Next, inhale, left hand inside of right foot, low twist, tap. Exhale, lift it up, use your obliques. Inhale, tap. Exhale, lift. Inhale, tap, this time stay, low twist. You can press into the fingertips, rotate and open the chest. Breathe in. Breathe out. Next, inhale, half moon, right hand down. Left arm high, stack hips and shoulder. On your exhale, low twist, bend into your right knee, back toes tuck under, right arm lifts. Again, open, half moon. Root into the right foot, bend into the right knee, low twist. Open up, half moon, this time we stay. Reach the left fingers high, flex through the left toes, breathe in, breathe out. One more inhale, exhale, land, warrior two. Deep bend in the right knee, reach the fingers long. Long spine, breathe in, breathe out. Inhale, reverse your warrior, reach back with the right arm. Exhale, side angle, right forearm to thigh. Let's flow that, inhale, reach back, reverse. Exhale, side angle. Final time, inhale, reach back. Exhale, side angle. This time, inhale, star. Exhale, prasarita, fold over the legs, drop the head. Maybe a little sway side to side. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, crawl back of the mat, low twist. Right hand down, left arm high, breathe in. Breathe out, horizons lunge, dip the hips, reach towards the right foot. Inhale, back to low twist. Exhale, dip the hips. Inhale, low twist. Last time, exhale, horizons. Inhale, low twist. Exhale, left hand down. Inhale, standing split. Exhale, Shiva squat, right knee behind left. Inhale, extend and lengthen. Exhale, pull it in. One more time, inhale. Exhale. Inhale, extend and lengthen. Exhale, right foot steps down, forward fold. Fingers can come around big toes. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, bend the elbows, drop the head. Shrug the shoulders down the back. Let the head and neck be really heavy. Breathing into the backside of the body. Release the hands from the feet. Heel toe the feet together, big toes touch. Next, inhale, chair pose. 
Hips low, arms high. Sit the hips back and down. Breathe in. Breathe out. Open twist to the left. Right arm forward, left arm back. Inhale, come back to center. Exhale, open twist. Inhale, center. Exhale, open twist. This time, stay. Breathe in. Breathe out, hands to heart. Lean forward. Hook right elbow on left thigh. Press the palms together. Rotate the chest open. Breathe in. And breathe out. Next, inhale, come back through chair. Exhale, stay low. Inhale, right knee to chest, one legged tadasana. Exhale, chair, ukitasana. Inhale, right knee to chest. Exhale, sit low. Inhale, knee to chest. Exhale, sit low. Beautiful. Inhale, knee to chest. This time, stay. Breathe in here. Breathe out, fly it back. Airplane, sweep the arms, extend through the right leg. Inhale, one legged. Right knee to chest, stand up tall. Exhale, fly it back. Inhale, lift. Exhale, fly. This time, stay. Draw the shoulder blades together. A little bit of up dog through the chest. Kick and lift through the back toes. And then inhale, reach the fingers forward. Interlace the fingers, press the palms away. Breathe in. Breathe out, pull. Knee to chest, palms to the thigh. Inhale, extend. Exhale, pull. One more time, inhale. Exhale, stay, and then come all the way up. Slide the hands to the shin now. Standing leg raise, you have options. Either right hand to the outside of the right foot, or you catch the knee. Breathe in. Breathe out, B variation. Right leg to the right, left arm to the left. Inhale, center. Exhale, open. Inhale, center. Exhale, open, beautiful. Inhale, center. Release the grip, reach the fingers high. Exhale, flying crescent. Back toes tuck under, front knee is deeply bent. Draw the shoulder blades together. Next, inhale, straighten through your left leg as you reach forward. Exhale, flying crescent, bend the knee, reach the arms back. Again, inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, high crescent now, arms lift to the sky. Square the hips, readjust through the feet. Breathe in, breathe out, open twist, right arm forward, left arm back. Inhale, lift. Exhale, open. One more time, inhale, lift. Exhale, open and stay. Draw the shoulder blades together, breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, tap right hand to the mat. Exhale, lift it up, open twist. Inhale, tap. Exhale, lift. Inhale, tap. Exhale, lift this time. Right hand to the mat, low twist. Breathe in. Breathe out. Next, inhale, left hand down, right arm high, half moon. Exhale, right hand down, left arm high, low twist. Again, inhale. And exhale. Last time, inhale, we stay. Left hand down, flex to the right toes, stack the shoulders, breathe in, and breathe out. One more inhale, exhale, land where you're to. Two feet on the ground, reach the fingers long, and then inhale, reverse, exhale, side angle. Inhale, reverse, exhale, side angle. One more time, inhale, and exhale. Beautiful, inhale, star pose. Exhale, prasarita, drop the head. Take a moment, maybe sway side to side, enjoy a fold. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, low twist, bend into your right knee. Left hand down, right arm high. Breathe in, breathe out, horizons lunge, reach back. Inhale, low twist. Exhale, horizons. One time, inhale. And exhale. Inhale, back through low twist. Exhale, right hand down. Inhale, standing split. Exhale, Shiva. Inhale, extend. Exhale, Shiva. One more time, inhale, extend. Exhale, Shiva. Inhale, extend, exhale, left foot. 
hips width distance. Padahasta, hands underneath the feet. Toes to the wrist. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, bend the elbows, fold. Drop the head. Reach the crown towards the floor. The tailbone up to the sky. And think about dragging the hands out from underneath the feet without actually moving them. That will energetically lengthen the backside of the body. Release the hands from the feet. This time, turn the toes out, heels in, malasana. Hands pull to heart center. Press the knees wide. Lift the crown to the sky. Find your breath. Maybe you play into crow. Maybe you stay and just enjoy a hip opener. And then as you're ready, lower all the way down into a seat and come onto your back. Feet together, knees wide, hands behind the head, elbows wide. Rest the head in the hands and then crunch. Head, neck, shoulders lift and lower. Pulling your ribs towards your hips. Feet are in supta bada legs. Option to set the feet flat if that feels better. This time, maybe you float the feet as you crunch and then tap the toes. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Last time. Hold it up. Now flex the feet. Drive the heels together. Extend the legs out. Pull them in. Extend. Pull. Extend. Pull. Good. Last time, keep the knees bent. Now reach the fingers forward, release thumb and index finger and pulse. Try to get the tips of the shoulder blades up. Good, last four, three, two, one. Release, pull the knees to the chest, breathe in. Breathe out, drop them left, gaze right. Inhale, come back through center. Exhale, drop the knees right, gaze left. Inhale, come back through center, hug the knees to the chest. Exhale, Savasana, legs long, arms open wide. Close the eyes, let the body get heavy. And enjoy finding stillness.
Take a deep breath in. And a deep breath out. Gently wiggle fingers, toes. Full body stretch. On the way to a seat, take your time. However you get there is up to you. Sit up tall with the eyes closed back down. Like the hands at the heart center, palms and fingertips to touch. As always, taking the last few moments of class to find presence before we move into the rest of the day. And in this moment of presence, I invite you to call in gratitude for making the intentional choice to show up on your mat today. Let's take a breath together. Inhale. Big exhale sigh. Let it go. As you're ready, blink the eyes open. Great work. I hope you absolutely loved this class. As always, please let me know down in the comments if you did, what classes you would like to see more of. And if you haven't already tried, I have an app called The Glow Method. There are over 500 classes over there. We do way more classes uploaded every single week. So this month was 17 total. We had a series and then we were uploading a bunch of other classes. We do live stream classes sometimes, and it's just really fun over there. You can create an entire calendar for your month or follow the one that I provide for you. There's a community page where we all chat and talk about all things yoga and wellness, and you get to choose the classes that you want every single month, and it's just really fun. So if you haven't already tried, there is currently a 14-day free trial still, so you have two weeks completely free, no strings attached. You can cancel your membership anytime. And one last thing, if you want to go to Tuscany, Italy this year, I would love for you to come with me. I'm hosting a retreat with my friend Maddie, who is a London-based Pilates instructor, and she's amazing, and I'm so excited for this retreat. It will be five nights six days and we're going to eat food that was grown on the land that we are sleeping on and it's a, a beautiful beautiful location in the mountains we'll do an italian cooking class there is a waterfall on the property that we will walk to and then dip in and there's a wood-fired sauna we're going to do a bunch of workshops it's going to be so fun so the link is down in the description for everything that i just offered and we are doing early bird $300 off. So definitely lock in the price this month if you want to join because it ends on May 6th. All right. Thanks so much for being here on YouTube as well. If you aren't subscribed, it really helps to support me and I appreciate it so much. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.